a Russian soldier came in wounded. The operation lasted more than four hours. Russian soldiers have no morality. My name is Oleg. I'm from the city of Kharkiv and I work with my father in an emergency hospital. My father is a surgeon. One day a Russian soldier came in wounded. He was dying. A Ukrainian officer on the phone told him that if we can save his life, our army could exchange him for one of our captured Ukrainian soldiers the Russians have. We immediately got to work. The Russian soldier had two shrapnel pieces penetrating a wound in the abdomen. These are very terrible wounds, because it penetrated deeply into him, and the shrapnel exited out on the other side and almost destroyed his entire intestine. The main issue in a surgery like this is that shrapnel doesn't travel a straight path. It has a tendency to bounce around within the body cavity and heat and cut all kinds of tissue. There may be bleeding that you cannot see. The other issue is the shrapnel breaks apart by design. So unless you have a CAT scanner, which we don't, you may not see it. This means that you constantly need to search for even the slightest amount of blood in the cavity. There is a lot of swabbing for this. The operation lasted more than 4 hours. It was incredibly difficult. Not only the physical and technical part, but the emotional part of knowing that this Russian soldier has killed our soldiers, but maybe tortured and raped our civilians as well. The whole time in the operating room we were just saying to each other, don't focus on him, focus on the Ukrainian soldier that will be freed if he lives. The operation was successful and he was placed in a separate medical ward with three of four Ukrainian soldiers guarding him in uniform. After the operation, my father visited him and asked him questions. For how much money did you receive from the Russian army to kill people? Just ordinary civilians. We said that we would not accept his bullshit of I came to training or I didn't know what was happening. No, it was already a month of war. And they knew that this is not training. They understand what they are doing here. He had to answer our questions. He then replied without hesitation, I get $300 from the Russian army to come here. But I really regret that I could not rob the houses to take everything to Russia and to sell there. His motivation has nothing to do with ideology. He is just a thief. My father decided to ask one last question. We will exchange you. Afterwards, will you come back to Ukraine as a soldier? I looked into his eyes, they were soulless. He then said, if there is a contract for a higher amount, for example $1000, then I will come back. Only a person who has no soul would say, I will come back to kill if there is more money to be made to the people who just saved his life. This event proved to me that Russian soldiers have no morality. They are very horrible people. I'm studying to be a doctor in school. When I become a surgeon, I hope that I can be as morally strong as my father to be able to treat people I despise.